Okay, a little bit of a closer look now, just um, I was sort of giving you a quick overview of the different angles and sides and features and differences between these two trios. This is just a little bit of a closer shot, it just helps to um, convey the, uh, the layout differences between the two keyboards. You can sort of see predominantly the trio uh, 600 on the right here had sort of rounder keys, the uh, newer generation ones here have sort of squarer keys. They probably, you know, each key probably uses a little bit more surface area than the, uh, the older ones, so it probably does make it a tad easier to, uh, to, um, to use them, to type out messages. And of course the obvious difference here between the uh, uh, the keys, uh, the sort of very shortcut keys here, which there's really some you know, extra two sort of uh, ones above here and the, the layout's a little bit different too. If I turn both of these on, um, certainly the, uh, the, um, the big difference between these two is the, um, the screen quality. Um, it's probably a little bit hard to tell here, you know, in detail, but I can tell you looking at these two screens and looking at the icons here on the menus, for instance, that the, um, in fact what I'll do is I'll actually just launch the uh, same application on the left here. Uh, wanting to try this out. So in fact what I'm doing here is, um, uh, let's see, we'll just uh, go back and just make them about the same. So really what you're looking at now are effectively the two the, the two same applications. I actually use Launcher X as a sort of very handy tad interface for my applications. So now what these are doing is they've basically got exactly the same applications and similar sort of um, uh, programs here and uh, as I say the screen on the left being 320 by 320 pixels definitely is uh, quite dramatically better than the old Trio 600. It's uh, everything is sharper. These things are going to keep turning off on me. Everything is a lot sharper and um, uh, you know, colours are a bit more saturated. Also, things like the menu, the little menu bar down the bottom, is actually smaller on the um, on the uh, the Trio 680 here. Um, and you can actually make the font sizes of the uh, the words on the menus a little bit smaller if you want, and, and yet they are still quite uh, sharp. So that's certainly a nice improvement, having a much better quality screen. And um, uh, we'll have maybe a look at a quick look at an application or two and see whether we can see any differences there.